from San Francisco, it's theCUBE. Covering Conga, Connect West 2018. Brought to you by Conga. Hey, welcome back everybody. Jeff Frick here with theCUBE. We are at Salesforce, Dreamforce. They say 170,000 people have descended into downtown San Francisco, it's absolutely bananas. We found a little respite, a little oasis, if you will. A couple doors down to the Thirsty Bear, it's the Conga Connect West event. Come on down, they've, they've rented out the Thirsty Bear for three days of, I just was told, free food, free drink, and a lot of entertainment. Also a lot of great Conga people as well, and the Cube's here, so come on by. We're excited to have for our next segment people that are really getting close to the customer. So at the end of the day, it's really about the customer. So we've got Natasha Reed, she is the senior product uh, management for Conga, good to see you. And also Justin Mongru, the VP of Sales Excellence from Conga. That's a great to see you. Before we get in, I got to ask you, Justin, that is a great title, VP of Sales Excellence. I mean, it really, it says something about what you think is important, which is being good at selling, not a used car sales, sales yeah. approach at all. How'd you come up with that, with that title and what, it, what does that personify for your team? Yeah, well I didn't come up with the title, but for, I think for us, Conga, what it, what it means, sales excellence is about selling with integrity. Our product provides real benefits to customers, and so um, unlike a lot of products where they, they can't talk about the full set, sales excellence to us is being able to really let the product shine and identify how it's going to help the businesses we work with. Right, and Natasha, that's what I hear you spend a lot of your time with customers on you know, your product management, but you're using a lot of customer input to drive what you prioritize, how you're kind of setting out your roadmap, what you're working on. Yes, absolutely. So from a customer perspective, um, we really pride ourselves on customer interviews. There's really nothing that helps you understand what customers are doing and using with your products than watching them firsthand in their own environment. And it really just provides invaluable feedback to help drive where we take our products in the yeah. future. It's funny, we, we did the Intuit QuickBooks Connect show a couple years ago, we had Scott Cook on, and he used to talk about it at, at Intuit. Um, they would just go, like you said, and sit and watch people engage with the application. Not even surveys, but you know, actually see how users use it. And it's, it's interesting, even if you watch someone else just use Excel, we all use it in, in a very different way. So that must be incredibly valuable feedback. Yes, I mean, you really see, you see the good parts of the application, you see parts that maybe need a little bit of improvement as well, but it's feedback that you really can't gather in any way except watching somebody. Right, I think it also it's a philosophy uh, that's very, very different than kind of looking at the competitors all the time. If you listen to Andy Jassy or Jeff Bezos at Amazon, right, who are just kicking tail and taking names, they're maniacally focused on what the customer wants. They don't really look about the, at the competition, they don't really talk about the competition, they're always looking at that customer. What do they need, what do they need next? And you guys are continuing to evolve your product line to kind of continue to go down that path. Well, and the reality is, is the customer defines the product in a lot of cases, right? It's um, what better way to understand your market than to talk to people that are already working with you and finding out what they want to buy next. Right, right. So you guys had some exciting announcements here uh, at, at Salesforce this year, where Salesforce is now integrating some of the Conga functionality inside of some of their core applications. If you could give us a little bit more color on that. Sure, so we just launched Conga invoice generation for Salesforce billing and Conga quote generation for Salesforce CPQ. So these two products are taking um, the power of the flagship document generation product, Conga Composer, and we're leveraging that functionality for very purpose-specific built document generation with Salesforce CPQ and Salesforce billing. That's pretty awesome. Yes, that is pretty awesome. <laughs> you got to stop. Hey, come on. So why did they pick you guys? What were some of the, what were some of the feature sets or, or working with Conga that, that helped Salesforce kind of come to this, this uh, decision? Sure, so Conga Composer, well known for best in class document generation, pixel perfect documents. So when you need to get your formatting just right, when you need very sharp, clean lines, et cetera, um, leveraging things like the ability to provide more information or merge uh, more product line items into your documents, um, as well as just supporting the formats that people want, things like Word and PDF. Yeah, and I would say in addition to the functionality, Salesforce also was able to trust just by seeing our customer experience through our net promoter score and our reviews online, knowing that they could partner with us and that we would take care of our joint customers the way they want them to be. That's a pretty significant 
move by them to adopt your guys' technology as part of the core within some of their, their it offerings. It is, it's, it's not something that Salesforce does often, so we're very proud and we're very grateful that they looked to us to help provide these solutions. I think another component of this is just ease of use. So very easy to install, lightning ready, um, very forward thinking in that capacity. Yeah, the um, the lightning thing is interesting. You know, kind of got to you get used to the old. You know, who moved my cheese? You know, I was like the old school uh, front end on Salesforce, and they finally made me jump over to Lightning. But I'm sure that opened up all types of new opportunities for you to deliver new functionality. And it does. In that. And I'll I'll empathize with that sentiment. I think change is always hard, right? People always struggle a little bit when they're used to doing something one way and Lightning is a very different look yeah. and feel from Salesforce Classic. I will say though that once you move to Lightning, um, Salesforce has done a really great job of, Lightning is more than just a CRM, it helps you do your job better. It makes suggestions, they put a lot of work into UI, user interface and user experience to make your to, to just, you don't have to think about how to do your job better, it actually just helps you do your job better. Right. So being able to build and develop on the Lightning Framework is actually a tremendous benefit. It has been. And then the last piece, you guys are sitting on a bunch of different pieces kind of in the in this document life cycle, if you will. You don't call it that, but you, you're into the contracts, you're into the document generation, you're into the life cycle management. So all these things too now, I imagine, are coming together in a more kind of synchronized, in yeah. a uh, cohesive way. Well, I mean, it's really, if you think about the customer story, they need to generate a document to communicate with their customers before they are a customer, and then they need to do a quote to show them how much it's going to cost, and they may or may not need to negotiate that, and then they need to sign it, and every business has this sort of interaction with their customers from here's what we do to do you like it enough to buy it from us to here's how we make that legally binding. I mean, that's, that's business and Conga has sort of met our customers along every stage of that journey that they go through in making a customer a customer and doing that in a visually stimulating professional way. Yeah. So fun fact about CongaSign or eSignature product that we launched in February of this year. eSignature was the number one feature request or problem to solve that the Conga customer base has provided over the last couple of years. So everybody wanted e-signature. We listened, we heard, and we built you e-signature. So how long did it take you to, <laughs> to get it out from the time you decided, okay, we'll go ahead. Well, and, we'll go ahead uh, and as, as the original product manager, I can actually answer that <laughs> very specifically. So we started building in July of last year, and we launched on February 13th of this year. So less than a year. Yes, Definitely yes. less than a year. Yep. Okay, great. And just final, final word, kind of thoughts on this event. Dreamforce, obviously a huge event for you guys. Big investment in this Thirsty Bear celebration at Connect West. What do you hope to get out of this week? What are you, what are you excited to see from, from both the Salesforce folks across the street, as well as this kind of gathering with all your customers? You know, for me, I hope to learn. I want to learn what our customers are interested in. I want to learn um, what our reps are seeing in the market as they walk around and what other businesses are doing and, um, and then learn from the ecosystem at what tools are available that we can use ourselves to better help our, our customer, which is our employees. So my favorite part of Dreamforce is actually the Conga booth at the Moscone Main Hall. So we actually get lots of our customers who come to find us, who come to find specific people. They'll come and ask for, hey, this support person helped us and they'll actually identify that person by name. Or hey, this professional services person helped us, can I meet them, are they here? And it's just incredibly gratifying. There's no, like it's very difficult to describe, but you have literally hundreds of people coming to find you to just say thank you, we love your products, it makes my life so much easier. You know, what else are you guys doing? That's great. And, and it, it is always so gratifying to know that there's someone on the other side you know, that appreciates the work and then it's always fun when you get some type of an electronic relationship to cement that with a face and a voice yeah, and a name and a handshake. Great, well thanks again for stopping by and congratulations on the big announcement. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, she's, he's Justin, she's Natasha, I'm Jeff. You're watching theCUBE, we're at Conga Connect West at Salesforce at Thirsty Bear. See you next time.